Hey there, this is Tyler Schindel, BU504, um, signature assignment presentation. Just wanted to say thank you so much for this class. It was really fun working on this project and hope you enjoy. So Virtue Fit Hub, a new way to work out. By Tyler Schindel. Virtual reality fitness studio. So essentially what this business is, it is a virtual reality fitness studio that all members can transport to using their phone. So by downloading an app, uh, getting a headset, virtual reality headset, you can put on uh, your phone and you can transport into a fitness studio with uh, top of the line um, instructors as well as uh, different people from around the world all working out in the class together. And the idea behind this was to create something where users didn't have to drive to a fitness studio to get that um, feel of a class where everyone's working together, encouraging one another, and you get that buzz of being in an actual fitness studio. And that was uh, the idea behind it. So uh, yeah, instantly transport into professional fitness studio. Like I said, you can do this from anywhere in the world as long as you have your phone and are a member of our club. Um, as well as engaging workouts, convenient access, and personal training. Uh, you can interact with other class members. So even though this is virtual, you are still able to interact with one, of the, one another, see the other people taking the class, talk to them, um, push each other. So it's very um, push each other physically, not actually push. But um, yeah, it's very um, interactive and a very cool uh, product, as well as uh, you can track your fitness progress. So there will be statistics and analytics behind how hard you're working out, um, how many calories burned, that kind of stuff, where your fitness level is compared to others in the class. Uh, so you can get in a personalized class that is exactly at your level, not expert if you're a beginner or not beginner if you're an expert. So it's very personalized on that level. Our intro advertisement will be, I'll move this because I think it's in the way. Uh, it'll be stay fit, stay home, join today and receive our complimentary VR headset. Uh, this will include expert training, endurance improvement, personalized programs and strength training. So with the intro advertisement, I wanted to include everything that you could see to understand what the business was. So obviously we have the woman up here, uh, clearly a workout um, athlete. And then we have the VR headset down low to show the two aspects of the business. So if someone were to just glance at this ad, um, the idea was that they would understand um, what the business was, what we, the product that we produced. Um, and then if someone was to get their attention caught and they read through uh, the writing on the advertisement, they would get a full understanding of what we do. So it was a little bit hitting both aspects of it. Um, we wanted to go direct to our target market. So obviously marketing towards athletes, people that enjoyed the fitness, um, but also hitting another crowd with the technology group where people that are interested in virtual reality may begin working out because of our product and because of using the uh, VR technology in there. And we also have a call to action through the QR code. Uh, so if you scan this QR code, it will take you to a signup sheet uh, where you can put your information in and actually get started um, that day if um, the headset gets to you in time. Yes, yeah, so we wanted to do effective marketing and. By doing so, we would create an emotional connection with potential customers. So especially when dealing with fitness, it's really centered around improving your life, uh, being more active, better mental clarity, uh, better mental health, all that kind of stuff. So really pushing towards effective marketing. Um, and by doing that, we'll inspire clients to make a lifestyle change. That was our whole pitch um, behind it. So as you can see in these two advertisements here, obviously, we have another uh, woman working out. And then we have the VR um teenager boy down here uh, showing off the two different aspects of what our company does and uh, as you can see change your mindset change your life virtue fit hub uh, start today so um yeah just the two different advertisements i also wanted to highlight here the uh, badge that we have so members were able to sign up and i could see something around posting you are a member of the group so a very cool trendy badge that you could post on your social media as well as display on your profile showing that you are a member of our club. Um, and then in the paper, you'll see uh, that we have a client testimonial in the caption for this photo here. So whether it's on social media or in a magazine, there will be a 
client testimonial talking about the changes uh, that joining Virtue Fit Hub has made to um, their life. So yeah. Social media campaign, uh, we'll be working with Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram mostly, uh, mostly Instagram. Um, and through our ad right here, you can see there's a free trial by scanning the QR code and also just the sleek futuristic design that we placed on this advertisement. I really liked including the um, same um, virtual reality headset and woman in both uh, ads because obviously up here this was the Facebook Twitter banner head that would probably be featured on our social media. Uh, so if they were able to go from the advertisement to our page, uh, the branding stays um, intact there. And especially using Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, we stay, we're staying away more so from uh, TikTok and the newer um, social media platforms because I think there is something to be said about um, working with the established brands that have been there for a long time. So that's why we want to focus on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Uh, Buzz Marketing will be using working with brand ambassadors as well as social media influencers. Um, but for the brand ambassadors, we're, uh, we'll be essentially mostly focusing with college athletes um, around the new NIL deals that have came into place over the last couple of years where college athletes are now able to make money and partner with different brands um, that they align with. So we think as a fitness company, it'll be very beneficial for us to partner with some of the popular student athletes around the country. And if they are able to endorse our brand, it'll give success around the target market that we are trying to um, obtain. So that's our idea around brand ambassadors. And I'll touch a little bit more on that after. And then with social media influencers, they've already established such a loyal follow following around um, posting every day and almost people view them as more friends than actual like influencers or famous people. So by targeting, um, targeting fitness influencers, um, people that really have a say in the industry will be super beneficial for us. So both the brand ambassadors and the social media influencers will receive obviously a free membership from us and then a free headset. And so they're able to try out our product and like authentically advertise it um, out to their clientele. And then both brand ambassadors and social media influencers will be able to work on a program through affiliate marketing. So they will each, they'll all get a code that they can send out to their uh, following. And then through the signups that come from their code, um, those brand ambassadors and social media influencers will receive um, compensation for working with us. Growing the customer base. So obviously through social media, um, trying to have an active presence on social media, very, very consistent, very trendy with um, the things that we were posting to get a good customer base from that aspect, as well as through the call or the collegiate brand ambassador. So working with friends, working with uh, the student athletes, really pushing their product um, is obviously there's incentive behind them getting um, compensation through the affiliate marketing, but also just helping us grow their brand. We hope that they enjoy our product. So they want to push it. And um, that's why they're getting the free membership. So they have the authentic feel of working with our company. Um, we want to be very proficient on exceptional customer service. So obviously working as a technology brand, there's bound to be um, technical, technical, technical difficulties and people writing in saying, Hey, my headset's not working. I'm having difficulty getting into the class. So we want to make sure our customer service is always very swift and also very just easy to explain the customer how to resolve their problem and get back into the um, product or get back into the class. Cause that's obviously why they're contacting us. Um, other things would be partnering with popular brands for our merchandise, such as Lululemon or obviously Fiori is very popular in Southern California. So um, working with brands that not only our ambassadors would want to wear, but also our customers would feel comfortable and proud to wear would be very um, beneficial for us. And then lastly, just referral based incentives that could be from a membership referring other members. They can get things like uh, discounts on merchandise or also um, discounts on their monthly membership fee um, are two different ways that we can um, referral based incentive to our current clients. And yeah, here's our references here and just wanted to say thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed the product. 
And it was really fun kind of building this business up from the ground. So yeah, very cool. Thank you very much. And uh, hope you have a great day.